YouTube. I'm back with another video. Today I'm working on a BMW i8. Door got the got the door fly open. Let's do a look. Let's do the both doors. Let's show us about. So we got the key here. Hold on. Let me get the key unlocked. Yeah, that's real dirty though. Look how filthy it is. Dirty, dirty. It's a full interior detail. It's got a brown interior, which is kind of weird. I've never seen that. Like a brown, but it actually kind of looks kind of good. Let me just uh unlock this bad boy real quick. Throw up the doors. Throw up the doors a little bit so you can uh, see what it looks like. Bam. So yeah. So what I have to do is full interior detail, like I said, then go to exterior detail. Throw some wax on it. I'm not sure if I have to polish it or not. The paint don't look too bad. I might do a single stage polish, just a one step. So I'm gonna go ahead and start cleaning the doors, which is kind of awkward, you see, because I got the butterfly fly doors. So let's uh, get my all-purpose cleaner. Got my little detail caddy, a little Milwaukee, pack out. First thing I'm gonna do is, this is an awkward spot. Spray this bad boy up on there. Spray that a little bit on there. Got my leather brush. A little awkward. Good thing there's not a lot of tight spots, so you don't have to use a little detail brushes to get it done. All right, so I got the door panel ready to go. Now I'm gonna go ahead and start with the the dash. Spray it on a little rag. I never spray it on, like I said, I never spray it on the you know I me mean, electronics or anything, because you get anything it'll soak inside the buttons and mess some kind of electronics up, then you have a big problem other than detailing. So first thing I do, I got my little brushes. So I'm gonna go and wipe down up here. Got so many little grooves and stuff. cup holders I'll just spray a little bit in here let it sit while I do the, the top leather the, the, the lid of the center console and just get that in there agitate it get my leather brush it's clean and then blow it out, put my rag in there. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get the seat scrubbed down and protected. The first thing I do before I uh, clean the leather, I try to get between these little cracks and grooves, the vacuum. Alright, 
And every time I clean the seats, I start from the top to the bottom. Start with the rims, start on the exterior, and we'll be good to go. All right, guys, so now I'm done with the interior. I'm gonna go ahead and start on the exterior. I'm gonna start with the rims, I'll go on the paint, and I'll put the wax on it. So let me go ahead and start this bad boy up. I'm gonna put my little cheap gear in down here. All right, first thing I do when I clean my rims is I just put my wheel cleaner. Little thing in there, get on there. All right. and I get the big easy detail brush, get the barrel. That's the most important thing, like I said, about cleaning rim is the barrel of your rim. I got the rims cleaned and ready. Now I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get the little jam and the little spots that I can't reach with uh, the mitt. So what I do is spray some all-purpose cleaner. This is all my all-purpose cleaner I put in there. So what I do is just get up in here.
right, so now I went ahead and sprayed the foam can on it. I'm gonna let it sit for a couple minutes, rinse it off. Then I'll go ahead and use the uh, wash mitt, in which I, when I do the wash mitt, I do panel by panel. Each panel, I spray it off with the hose. I don't do the two bucket method. I just spray the, the mitt off, and then go to the next. Got this uh, BMW i8, all detailed and ready to go. You can just tell, boy, it looks good, waxed, protected.